The Final Letter Have you ever heard of the story, and it's not a famous story, but it's a story of perseverance, tears, but most of all growth. The name of the story is Chain Around the Rose. One day this bird planted a seed. It planted the seed in a dark place and then it flew away. While the bird went away, the seed began to grow, but it only began to grow because a rose nourished it. And yes, it was a rose. While the seed began to grow through the years, it began to wonder who was the bird who had planted him among the thorns. So the seed began to contemplate what it would become over and over again until the seed continued on. Now the seed began to develop its looks, but of course it still did not understand everything it would become, especially being surrounded by chains and of course all the thorns. Time went by and the seed became older, old enough to understand certain things about the bird who had planted him, as well as the place where it was planted at. So now the seed began to develop a sense of urgency to succeed for the rose who had nourished it. Time went by. Now the seed has grown to realize what it is and what it will become. However, there are some new complications outside of the area where the seed had grown. In other words, the seed moved on from the chains where it was born. Now the seed has to nourish itself and make sure that it has to continue on. So do you know how the seed nourished itself? Well, the seed did it like this. It worked hard watering itself, feeding itself more knowledge. And through the ups and downs, the seed continued to grow. The seed even watered itself through its own tears because through its own tears, the seed continued to grow. And finally the seed became what it was to become, which was a rose. But the only reason why it knew how to nourish itself was due to the rose and all of its help. Now the seed that grew into the rose amongst the chains would like to give roses to the rose that helped him break out of the chains. Mama, you deserve your roses while you're still here and much more. Just want to say thank you for everything you have done for me. Thank you for always being there for me. Thank you for teaching me what true love is. And thank you for displaying that love to my family, to me, to my brothers, to all of my cousins, to every single person that you have come across. You don't know how special you truly are. And I told you you're a superwoman, but now I'm also telling you that you're a rose that deserve her roses while she's still here. I love you, mama, from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for everything.